to get started. 30 minutes, quick hit tonight. How this is gonna work, we're gonna have three different rounds. First round is gonna have three different exercises. We'll go through that two rounds. Second set of exercises, we go through three rounds. We finish off this Tuesday with a Tabata Tuesday, which will be four rounds. So two rounds, three rounds, and four rounds. 30 minutes, we're hitting this hard. You guys will get your heart rate up, a little bit of strength always built into my classes. So I hope you guys are ready. All right, Tuesday, let's get started. Find the back of your mat. Take a couple deep breaths just to get started. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, open those arms, open up that chest. Inhale, reach up. Remember to breathe through today's class. Exhale, reach those arms down. Inhale one more time. Exhale, you're gonna lunge forward with that right leg. Drop that back knee towards your mat. Reach both arms up high. And then you're gonna lower those arms halfway. Rotate towards that right bent knee. Open up that spine, come back to center. Sweep both arms up overhead. Come back down halfway, rotate towards that right leg, come back to center, step it back, opposite side. Left knee's kind of come forward, both arms sweep up high, rotate towards that left leg, now come back to center, then sweep both arms up one more time, come back to center, opening up that right hip flexor, opening up that back, step it back. One more time each side, both arms sweep up, come back to center, rotate over that right leg, back to center. Right arm sweep up, back to center, rotate to the right, and back to center. Step it back. Left leg forward, both arms sweep up. We're gonna rotate towards the left, back to center. Again, opening up that right hip flexor, opening up that spine, rotate, and then we step it back together. Separate your feet just a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. Give me 10 body weight squat, Dropping those hips down low. Your knees are driving out towards your second and third toe. Don't be afraid to sit low on these. We will see squats in the middle of today's class. In three reps, we're gonna hold down. We're gonna open up those hips, warm up those ankles. In two, last one, hold this down. Take those elbows inside your knees if you can. Then you're gonna rock to the left and right, warming up those ankles. Think about massaging those ankles, giving them a little bit of lubrication in those joints. And then you're gonna take both hands to the ground, lift your hips up towards the ceiling, so from the side. And then you're gonna give a micro bend in your knees and then straighten those hips all the way up towards the ceiling. Opening up the back sides of those legs, opening up those hamstrings. We have three more reps here and then we're gonna roll it up. For three, two, and one, take it all the way up for four, three, two, one. Last part of this little mobility warm up. Inhale, reach up, exhale. Walk it out, inchworm to the top of your mat. Find that high plank, shoulders directly over wrists. Lift those hips up into a down dog and then walk your hands back up. Inhale, reach up, exhale, inchworm, top of your mat. Finding that perfect high plank, shoulders over your wrists. Glutes and quads are squeezing. Lift those hips up towards the ceiling, inverted V, and then walk those hands back up. One more time, and then we're gonna get this 30 minutes of quick hit started out. Walk those hands forward, hold on to that high plank for a second, press up into that down dog, and then walk your hands back up. Awesome job, guys. Grab some water, warm up anything else you might need. Hi, Naz. Hi, Heather. Welcome guys, again, this is going to be 30 minutes, quick hit. First round is gonna look like this. 30 seconds of work, 15 seconds to recover. We have three exercises, we see these two times. So, exercise number one, cross jack. Right hand is gonna jack to your left foot, jump back together. Left hand, right foot, jack back together. Modification, just keep your feet wide, tap right hand, left foot, this is your no impact. Exercise number two is going to be a walking plank. So you're gonna find your high plank position, you're gonna walk your hands laterally down your mat, and then walk back. Modification, just hold that high plank position. Exercise number three is going to be 
scissor kicks along your mat. So scissor jumps along your mat. No impact modification would just be knee to chest right here. All right, guys, 30 seconds of work, 15 seconds to recover. We only see this for two rounds. Get my timer ready. We are gonna move into those cross jacks in just about 10 seconds. All right, Tuesday, let's get this started. In five seconds, we're taking off into those cross jacks in three, two, and one. Here we go, 30 seconds of work. You're dropping those hips down low, taking it into a wide squat position. Your right hand comes to your left foot, left hand, right foot, working those obliques as you cross that body. You guys are over halfway, here we go. Last 10 right here. You get 15 seconds to recover between each exercise. In three, two, one, we rest. All right guys, we take it into a high plank, walking laterally down your mat. So find your high plank position. We move in three, two, one. So you're stepping your arms out towards the side and your feet at the same time. So left hand, left foot steps out. If you need a modification, this is too much on your shoulders, feel free to just hold that high plank position for this 30 seconds. Here we go, guys, last 10. Making sure those shoulders are over your wrists, your hips are staying nice and stable. In three, two, one, we stand it up. Exercise number three, third and final exercise. Scissor kicks along the length of your mat. If you need no impact, you go knee to chest. Here we go. In three, two, and one. 30 seconds right here. Breathe through this, guys. Woo. I told you we were starting off hot. Your heart rate should be rising. You're halfway. 10 seconds left, you keep going. I'm just gonna check this. Hi, Banta. Hi, Brandon. Awesome, guys. Keep going. For three, two, and one. Nice work, guys. 15 seconds rest. That's round one. We see those three exercises one more time. Starting off with those cross jacks right here. In three, two, and one. Right back to the top. All right, guys. You've seen these three exercises. You know what to do. Try to pick up your pace this round. These high intensity intervals are meant to spike your heart rate and then you get the short burst to recover. So take advantage, here we go. Last five seconds right here in three, two, and one. Nice work guys. High plank, walking, or hold that high plank for 30 seconds. Drop it down. Get ready to set up for that high plank. In three, two, and one. Here we go. Right arm, right leg steps out together. Again, keeping those hips nice and square to the mat. They are not rocking side to side. You could balance something on my back as I move down the mat. Bear crawl position is always a great option as well. Find what's working for you today. Here we go guys, finish out strong. For three, two, and one, nice work. All right, we finish out this first round with those scissor jumps going down your mat. Here we go guys, finish out this first set strong in three, two, and one, here we go. So arms are moving with your legs. Again, always a good modification. Just knee drives. Do three on the right and then three on the left. Otherwise, using those inner thighs, keeping everything nice and engaged as you move along the length of that mat. Here we go, guys, last five. In three, two, and one. Nice work. Grab some water. 
Round one is complete. Good work, guys. Hi, Lolo. All right, guys, round two is gonna look like this. We are gonna do 30 seconds of a strength exercise, followed directly by 20 seconds of a plyometric exercise. So we're gonna load those muscles, and then you're going to use a plyometric to jump with it. So, how this is gonna work. First round, you've got lateral lunges for 30 seconds. So, right leg steps out, left leg steps out. You're gonna go directly into 20 seconds of skaters. So you load the movement with those lateral lunges, go right into your skaters. Second exercise, you guys are gonna give me push-ups either on your knees or all the way out. And then you're gonna go directly into 20 seconds of burpees, all the way down, all the way up, okay? Final exercise, you will have a sumo squat to a frogger jump. So 30 seconds wide squat, squeezing those inner thighs to come up, directly into a frogger jump right here. Always an option to not do any of the jumps, take out the impact, stick with that strength exercise for the entire 50 seconds of work. All right, guys, here we go. 30 seconds on of strength, 20 seconds of that plyometric exercise. We see this set three rounds. So I like to face laterally along my mat for those lateral lunges. I'll demonstrate in both directions for you guys. Here we go. Starting out with those lateral lunges. In five, four, three, two, and one. Here we go, step out to the side. Step those hips back, alternating sides each time. So if you step out to the right, your right hip, knee, and ankle are all in the same plane. Drop those hips low. From the front, it looks like this, side and side, right here. I'm limited to this small window that Instagram gives me, but drop those hips low. Guys, in three seconds, we move directly into skaters in three, two, one, here we go. Skaters, no rest in between. You go right from that strength movement into that plyometric. 10 seconds from the front, we look like this. Stay low on those skaters. Last three, two, and one. Nice work. Okay, 15 seconds. We go right into push-ups for 30 seconds, burpees for 20 seconds. I rarely do burpees. I must have been in a mood when I <laughs> created this workout today, guys. So get ready. Find your push-up position either on your knees or full push-up. In three, two, and one. Here we go. So 30 seconds of push-ups, moving right into 20 seconds of burpees. If you're down on your knees, make sure your hips are forward. You're in a straight line from your knees all the way up to your shoulders. You're dropping that chest all the way to your mat. Pressing up. Last 10 seconds, we move right into those burpees. Here we go for three, two, and one. Jump it in. Option to jump up. Take it all the way down. Drive those knees in and up. Here we go, guys. It's only 20 seconds. You get 15 seconds to rest on the other side here. You can do it. Push yourself through this. You got it, guys. Last three, two, and one. Rest. Woo! You guys should be feeling that. Okay, guys. Third set here. You start in a wide sumo squat. Working through that sumo squat, and then you go right into those froggers. 30 seconds of sumo, 20 second froggers. Let's get ready. In three, two, and one. Here we go. Drop those hips low, squeeze those inner thighs as you lift. Down and up. Again, your knees should be driving out towards that second and third toe. It's okay if they drive 
out over your toes. Sit low into that squat. In 10 seconds, we move into that frogger. This is round one. You see this set two more times. In three, two, and one. Here we go. Right into those froggers. Drop those hips low as you tap the ground. Your back should not be hinging forward. You should keep that chest up nice and tall. Explode off that ground. Keep going for three, two, and one. Nice work, guys. Round one down. You see that two more times. So now you know how this works. We load the movement with that strength exercise, and then we use the plyometric to explode. So catch your breath. Grab a sip of water if you need to. From the top, lateral lunges going into those skaters. Here we go. You've got five seconds moving into lateral lunges. In three, two, and one. Here we go. Step it out and together. Alternating sides. Again, bringing that hip, knee, and ankle into the same plane as you step out to the side. In 15 seconds, this lateral lunge turns into a skater jump. Sit it low, guys. We stay low into those skaters. In three, two, and one. Here we go. Right into those skaters for 20 seconds. Again, always feel free to take out that impact and stick with those lateral lunges. <laughs> Keep going for three, two, and one. Nice work. All right, our push-up set is coming up next. Option on your knees, option full push-up. 30 seconds of push-ups, 20 seconds through that full burpee. Here we go, guys. In three, two, and one. If you're in that push-up, drop that chest all the way to the ground. Again, if you're on your knees, creating a nice long line from your knees all the way to your shoulders. Those elbows should be going back at a 45 degree angle. They should not be winging out to the side like chicken wings. Keep them in. Last three, two, one. Right into burpees, all the way up, all the way down. Here we go. If you're no impact, hold that high plank or continue with your push-ups. Last 10, here we go. You can do it, guys. For three, two, and one. Nice work. Third and final exercise of this set, sumo squat right into those frog grip jumps. Here we go. Feet are a little wider than your normal stance. We get started in three, two, and one. Here we go. Sumo and up. Hips drop low, squeezing those thighs to come to standing. Think about zipping it up. Those knees should not be inside of that big toe. They are driving out wide. Last 10, we move right into those froggers. Guys, after this, we get a sip of water. We have a little longer recovery. Let me see this set one more time. And go, froggers, here we go. All the way down, all the way up. Explode off that ground. No impact, you stay. Just add the reach. Here we go. Last five for three, two, and one. Nice work. Awesome job, guys. I don't know about you, but I'm sweating. Woo! All right. Lauren, I wish we could walk. If I didn't have this set up, I would show you guys outside. It is pouring. In Chicago so again sorry if I'm a little bit darker than normal all right guys we see those three exercises just one more time again this is only 30 minutes of work so give me your best effort for the next nine minutes we have left together Tuesday we are back to the top lateral lunges and skaters are coming up 
Hi, Alec. Hi, Jeremy. All right, in three, two, and one. Here we go. Lateral lunge. Step it out. From the front, we look like this. Sitting out, your weight shifts over to the knee that you are bending. Opposite leg stays straight. Hold on to this. Last 10 seconds right here. We move right into those skaters. In five, four, three, two, and one. Here we go. 20 seconds of skaters. Stay low. From the front, you're here. Stepping it back, opposite hand reaches to opposite foot. Stay controlled here for three, two, and one. Here we go. Guys, last set of push-ups, last set of burpees coming up right here. Promise, no more push-ups today. Take it down to your high plank position. 30 seconds of push-ups, 20 seconds of burpees. In three, two, and one. Guys, wherever you are, whatever level you're at, just give me your best effort for the next seven minutes of class that we have left together. Maybe you do a couple push-ups on your toes, a couple on your knees, whatever feels best for your body today. In five seconds, we move into those burpees. Best 20 seconds yet. Here we go in three, two, one. Jump it in all the way up, jump it out all the way down. Come on guys, push through it. Last 10 seconds here. For five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work. All right, we finish up this set. Sumo squats and froggers coming up. I'm wearing a different rubber band. My hair is crazy today. <laughs> Hope you guys are sweating like I am. Final set, here we go. 50 seconds of work. We grab some water, we recover before our final Tabata set. Here we go Tuesday, feet out wide, moving into those sumo squats. In three, two, one, here we go. Hips drop low, knees out wide. Zip it up. Take this sumo squat to take some deep breaths. Slow down your heart rate before we pick it right back up into those jumps. In 10 seconds, we move into those frogger jumps. Here we go. In five, four, three, two, one. Right into it. Tap the ground, explode up. Tap, explode. Drop those hips low. Back stays up, chest is lifted. Last 10 seconds here. After this, we just have one final Tabata set, guys. Four minutes of work in three, two, one. Rest. Woo! Awesome work. Hi, Kaylee. Thanks, AJ. All right, guys. Final four minutes of work. First round, we did two sets. Second round, we did three sets. Third round, we do four sets. But it's only 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds to recover. If you guys are following my April Wellness Challenge, this is the last week. Every day is a little bit different mountain climber variation. So our Tabata today is going to be high knees for 20 seconds or just alternating knees, mountain climbers for your second 20 seconds. We see those two exercises for four rounds. A tough four minutes of work, it will be exactly a 30 minute hit, then we are done for the night. Let's work hard for this last four minutes. I'm sweating too, Heather, I'm glad you are. Okay, let me set this up. I will give you a little bit different variation for each mountain climber and high knee set just to give you guys a little bit of excitement here okay let's do this guys four minutes of work less give me your best effort right here 
We start with those mountain climbers. We drive those knees up. Here we go, final sets. In five, four, three, two, one. Here we go, high knees. Regular high knees this first round. Focusing on driving those knees up. So from the side, those knees are up above my hips. Those arms are working. We have five left. In three, two, and one. We drop it down to our high plank. We've got regular mountain climbers for your first set. Here we go. In three, two, and one. Drive those knees forward. 20 seconds of work. Make sure those shoulders are right over those wrists. You're not drifting backwards. Drive through this. Final three, two, and one. Nice work. That's round one. Three to go. Option on this second round to give me lateral my high knees. And go. So you can take it down your mat and back down. I don't know. I always feel better when I get a little bit more movement along. Otherwise, if regular high knees are suiting you, stick with those guys. This is your workout. In three, two, one. Here we go. Taking it down to your mountain climbers. Option, knee to opposite elbow this time. Cross climbers coming up in three, two, and one. Here we go. So right knee, left elbow. Left knee, right elbow. Your high plank, nothing else changes. You stay in that perfect high plank position. Nice and stable, last five. In three, two, and one. We're halfway, two down, two to go. Two more minutes of work, guys. Let's go, give me your best effort. In three, two, one, high knees. Back to regular. I don't know if you guys can hear, but the thunder is really picking up outside. I'm getting a little darker in here. Here we go, last five. In three, two, one, rest. Regular mountain climbers for your third round. Here we go guys, finish out this third round strong. In three, two, and one. Drive it forward. I'm doing this with you guys, I know I'm pushing you. I'm giving you the guidelines. You make the most of your own workout tonight. So give me your best effort, final five seconds. We stand it up, we have one more round. In three, two, one, stand it up. This is it guys, you see each exercise one more time. We are done, I am sweaty, my hair is everywhere. I hope yours is too. Lateral climbers in three, two, one, here we go. Option for climbers down your mat. Other option, you stay in place. Option three, you just give me standing high knees. For three, two, one, this is it. Final 20 seconds of class, cross climbers. Knee to opposite elbow in three, two, one. Here we go. Knee to opposite elbow, you drive. Nobody drops. This is it, your final 10 seconds of class. Every bit of energy you have left comes here. In three, two, one. Give yourselves a round of applause. That was awesome, guys. That's 30 minutes of quick hit. I am Brittany Corman. This is the Weekday Warrior. If you guys are not participating, I have an April challenge that is posted up. This week, the winner gets a free 45 minute personal training session with me. And I also offer telehealth for physical therapy, online virtual training, and individualized workout programs. Thank you guys so much for joining me. If you guys have any questions, <laughs> I'm glad I came to your butt. I'm sweating. Woo. So, if you guys have any questions, comments, anything at all, feel free to direct message me and I will answer anything that you guys have. This will be up for 24 hours. I'm hoping to figure out how to save this, this whole Instagram thing. I'm going to go shower in the rain also. Thank you guys so much. Love seeing all of you in here.
appreciate it. 